Thanks. Despite the cool weather, thousands of people turned out for today's UPATH Ride for the Arts on Milwaukee's lakefront. And our Tom Murray reports from the finish line. Here at the finish line, many riders wearing long sleeves, pants, even coats on a chilly Ride for the Arts. It's estimated that more than 7,000 riders set out on this year's UPATH Ride for the Arts, undeterred by the forecast and they came set for all kinds of weather. The wind was with us on the way south and it was against us on the way back. So you're riding against the wind uphill? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How so was that, that? That's a challenge. Cyclists on the long distance routes took on the Hone Bridge, one of the rare opportunities to pedal over this Milwaukee landmark. And a few even posted Instagram photos on Twitter during the ride definitely cooler by the lake. We are pretty hardy here in Wisconsin, and I think people are accustomed to being able to uh, be athletic no matter what the weather is. The ride benefits the United Performing Arts Fund, channeling money to Milwaukee theater, music, and dance. I see you guys are wearing sweatshirts, long pants. It looks like it was chilly out there today. It was cold, yeah. Could use some gloves. <laughs> We did see gloves, these bundled up finish line cheerleaders on what many consider one of the first Sundays of summer. It was a little chilly, but it was fun. Uh, went over the home bridge, did the 25 mile bike ride. This is a big fundraiser, UPAP hoping to raise $11 million in total this year for the arts community. At the Summerfest grounds, Tom Murray, today's TMJ4.